Hello everybody, and welcome back to Pandemic Love. Last time we left off, we were introduced to Trond and how he sees the world around him through this tough, tough time in the pandemic. Right now, we are trying to find ourselves a way to entertain ourselves, actually. Uh, I think we actually have to go to the living room, right? I think that's where we're going. Alright, to the living room then. Across the street. Looks like someone is there. <gasps> Who is it? Is it your neighbor? Hmm? What is she doing? What are you doing? Why aren't you wearing a face covering? It's a pandemic, isn't it? Wait. What the fuck am I doing? This is sad, even for me. Whatever. I'm not doing anything wrong. Well, I got nothing better to do. Are you watching her through your window? Through her window, too? That's kind of strange. Um... I, I guess I'm gonna say, what the fuck am I doing? I'm like, really confused as well. I wouldn't say whatever, that's kind of weird. It's kind of like stalkerish vibes. Yeah, I'm gonna say, what the fuck am I doing? Yeah. It's only been a day in house arrest. I just ain't there yet. Yeah. I should probably do something else. How about some TV? That spirit, let's see what's on the news, or watch cartoons. Well? Well, that was oppressing as fuck. Come on, Trond. You gotta find channels that make you happy. Cartoons, TV shows, you have Netflix, YouTube. You can watch gaming commentary. That would be cool. Knock, knock, knock. Huh? Knock, knock, knock. Who is this? Who's knocking? Who the fuck knocks anymore? Wait, Trond, are you telling me that people just barge into your house? Who even knocks? They just open the door, just be like, Hey, I'm in! I'm coming in! <laughs> they just kick down your door, FBI style. <laughs> Alright, we guess uh, go into the hallway then. Hello, who is this? Knock, knock. Whoa, what do you have going on up top left here? You have, like a little mouse pinned to the wall. Please, chill out, man. Uh huh. Hello? Ooh. Oh, hi! I'm Sil. Sil. Silje? Silje. I must all call you Silje. Uh. Hmm. Hello. Silje, I guess. Hello. Are you all right in there? Hmm. What's going on? Who the hell are you? I'm Silje. Um, <laughs> yeah, I got that. Really? That's a sweet, sweet name. I'd never be able to guess that. <laughs> Damn, that's our cousin. <laughs> uh, let's say, yeah, I got that. That's good. <laughs> you don't want to say your name? Neighbor, are you trying to make friends with me? Friendo? <gasps> no way. Oh no, of course not. If you don't want to, your personal information is you're always your own to give or keep. Privacy is key. Silje knows what's up. Silje? I still don't know how to pronounce that. Okay. Anyway, I'm Trond. Also, why are you here? Yeah, why are you outside my apartment door? What do you want? That's a real question here. Oh. I'm working from home, so I'm going around doing what I can to help people. Oh, cool. So you're just coming by to visit and check in on people. That's very sweet of you. Asking if people need anything from the store, you know? Isn't that dangerous? Yeah, it's a pandemic, it's kind of scary. Oh, that's nice of you. Oh, uh, you mean pestering isolated people? That's, that's negative. We don't want negativity here, that's pessimistic. Let's say that's nice of you. Thank you. You're welcome, Sylvie. I try to do what I can. Oh, I already know. I think Sylvie might be my favorite character. <laughs> Such a nice, generous, kind person. So, are you, um, unavailable? What? What are you talking about? Well, information of illness is a sensitive information according to GDPR. You can't just throw important information around like that. It makes me feel like this. Huh? Are you... Okay? Oh, so yay. I'll be there to talk to you, buddy. Sure. How about you? I'm... not sick. But you're... Unavailable. I guess you can call it that. 
If that's a nice way to say quarantine. I guess. I guess that's a nice way to say quarantine, but if he calls it unavailable, then I guess so. I'm gonna say this. Um, don't really know if there are any nice ways to say that. Thanks for trying. Welcome. <laughs> He's yelling at us. You're welcome. So, oh. are you quarantined? Silier, that is none of your business, man. I just met you. I can't be just describing my whole life scenario right here through a door talking to you about this. <laughs> Come on, man. It's a pandemic. I don't even know how you're outside right now. Like, aren't you afraid? I... Oh, are we blacking out? Are we having PTSD? Oh, jeez. Dark things crawl past me, shrieking, clawing at me, trying to drag me down. Fear. Pounding fear. Like I've never felt before. Shudder. Someone cries for help. Oh man, what the heck is going on? Jeez. I run. This is scary. Jesus. Trond? Hmm? You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Tell you? What? Oh, he's asking about your life story, I guess. <laughs> it's okay. I'm not the only one being quarantined at the moment. Hmm. Are you all alone in there? Yep. You should try to call your family. That helps, I find. Aw, oh, thanks, Sylvia. I mean, earlier Tron said he'd try to call people, but he was like, ah, oh, there's no one left to call. I don't know if that's a, a, a thing where he means, like, everyone got infected, and they all, like, are in critical condition, or if they're just quarantined away and they don't have access to a phone, or if they're actually just dead. Um, I don't know. Thanks for the su uh, suggestion, Cilie. Hmm? Oh, he's happy. That was a good, uh, good advice. Thank you. <laughs> Ain't real an option, but thanks. Maybe Tron just doesn't have a close connection to his family. Oh. Don't worry about me. I've always managed by myself. So... Do you need some shopping done? Um, maybe some smokes. Nah, no, no, we don't want smokes. They'll, uh, damage us. We don't want that. Uh, yeah. I, I think some other day, but thanks anyways is a good one. Because I don't think we really need anything. Yeah, thanks anyway. I don't want to send Cilia out and risk him getting, him or her, I guess, uh, infected. So, I'm going to pass for now. Thank you, though, Cilia. I appreciate it. Some other day, then. I should get going. There are a lot more doors to knock on. Stay safe out there, Silye. Stay strong. Yeah, there you go. Stay safe out there. Good luck. <laughs> Try not to get killed. Damn. That's so pessimistic. I don't... I wouldn't say that to anybody. Unless it was my friend just to be joking around. But like, no. I hope you stay safe out there. I will. It was nice talking to someone. Yeah, see, you got to socialize a little bit. That's That's nice. Oh, likewise, Tron. Bye. Laters. We made a new friend. Right. Now what? Silence. I'm creeping back. Slowly. Slowly. Filling the room. Oh no. Making every little... Noise. Noise. Noise echo. It was supposed to be noise, I'm assuming. Yeah. Is it time for dinner yet? Quarantine, quarantine time. Would you look at that? It is. Haha, <laughs> we're in the kitchen now. All right. What's for dinner today? I could try out my new hobby. That could be good. But what could I make with the things in my kitchen? That is a good idea. But unfortunately, I am all out of time for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're going to have to continue this off in the next video because 
you know, we have four choices to make, and these four choices could potentially change the ending of this game. I actually don't know if there's multiple endings or not. <laughs> It'll be kind of funny, though. But thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Write a comment down below and tell me what you guys thought about this. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're interested and want to see more content. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video, guys. Bye, guys! See if out there.